So since the start of the year, I've been um, working with uh, Afghani Sikhs who have been refused asylum um, on the grounds that they're not sick. So I've, I've been brought in as, a, as an expert to basically establish their sickness, sickness. Um, and rather than using kind of textbook questions about their knowledge of Sikhi, like, you know, can you name the 10 gurus, which most people should be able to, but even a lot of British Sikhs, Sikhs born in Britain wouldn't be able to. Um, they can, they can all name the five Ks, but, um, but they often ask questions about Sikh history. Rather than do that, I've asked, asked, I've asked some questions about Sikh practice. So, for instance, you know, what happens at Sukhasan when Guru Granth Sahib is put, is, is put away at the end of the day? Um, who, who's your favourite ragi? Questions like that. So more about their Sikh practice, more about what goes on in the home. Um, and it's been quite, quite a revelation for me. I've, I've, I've interviewed, as I say, about 10 families um, so far. And many of them have come from um, a particular area of Afghanistan called Khorst. And I've um, heard some of their stories, some of their experiences in, in Afghanistan, some of their um, the routes in which they've got to the UK. Um, and they're, they're pretty, pretty harrowing accounts, to be honest. And I think it's important, especially given recent events um, which took place in Afghanistan um, with the suicide bombing, that um, Sikhs in Britain support Afghani Sikhs as much as possible, whether that be through helping them, helping them with asylum applications, helping them establish their sickness, um, helping them with their education. So many I've spoken to have had their schooling disrupted due to moving around Afghanistan or you know going to Moscow, for instance. And finally, don't discriminate. So we have lots of people talk about different communities and Sikhs are just as bad or Afghani Sikhs like this, Afghani Sikhs like that. Human beings are human beings, don't discriminate. If you can help somebody, somebody out, help them out. Um, if you see an Afghani Sikh on the industry, then you know, commiserate with them about what happened and do try and support them when you can. Why would you go Khalsa? Why would you go?